Lincoln, historic starting point of the flat racing season, drew the customary huge crowds eager to be in on the first leg of the spring double. The old firm's worries didn't spoil this punter's appetite, but all the same, heavy going promised to upset a lot of calculations. Many hopes were pinned to the Duke of Norfolk's favourite Burpham, favoured by the draw as the 40 runners got away to a spectacular start along the Lincoln Mile. Follow them now from our camera car as Hatchick, number 11, and the French horse Roque du Diable, number 2, take the lead, with Goldsborough, number 8, just behind. Barnes Park, Fancy Fly and So are well there, and so is Dramatic, the second favourite, ridden by Gordon Richards. Furlongs to go, and still no challenge from Burpham, the favourite. There is the camera, it's Seo, number 33, steadily improving his position, drawing level with Goldsborough, now leading in the centre of the course. Head on as they tackle the halfway climb, and still it's anybody's race. For the crowds at fever pitch, it's Seo in front, confident and full of going. Just behind comes Dramatic, number three, and watch him now, putting out a tremendous effort as Gordon Richards, with perfect timing, takes him into the lead. Yes, that's Gordon, that was, tearing into the final furlong with an unbeatable finishing burst. Fair judgment, last year's winner comes into second place, while Dramatic sweeps on to a three-length victory. What a race, she says, but never mind, old man. There's always the Grand National. Anyway, it was an amazing achievement for a horse paralyzed by rheumatism last year, and yet another popular triumph for Gordon Richards, champion of champions.